Marcus, I, you've, you've got a very interesting story, like I said, and um, people can see it in lots of detail on Wired and on YouTube videos. And we don't expect you to do the same here. But could, if you just could give us like the highlights of, you know, your background, because I want to I want people just to realize that you did something really special. Um, you've got an interesting story. But what's really cool, I think, is that you're taking that knowledge and experience and now you're helping others who, for instance, are trying to get into cybersecurity. So if you could just give us the quick rundown, you know, of how, how we got to where we are today. Okay, so I think the quick rundown is, um, so I started out writing malware as like a teenager. I got out of that, got into cybersecurity, ended up stopping WannaCry, which was this global ransomware virus that was launched by North Korea. Right after that happened, I kind of ended up getting thrust into the spotlight in somewhat uncomfortable way. And then yeah. immediately I got uh, picked up by the FBI on the old stuff I did as a teen. And then kind of as that all blew over, I just started teaching. Yeah, I love it. I mean, I, I, I think you've said or I've seen it said that you like were the most famous person in the UK for two days. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty accurate. Yeah, I mean, I just say, I mean, I'm based in the UK. So just for everyone who's watching who don't know who the, what the NHS is, it's the National Health Service in the UK. And I mean, it was a, it was a major problem. And you, if I mean, it's better if you tell the story, but you registered a domain that basically was a kill switch for one of cries, that right? Yeah, so uh, yeah, it beaconed out this domain. It's not really... Sh- it's not clear why, but um, basically if the domain is online, it will just cease all activity. Like it doesn't encrypt the files, it doesn't spread. And uh, I typically register these kind of domains as a, uh, as a job. Like we will try and find unregistered malware domains and then hijack the malware. So I went and registered this one and it, it just stopped the entire cyber attack. 